is Jessica and welcome back to my channel. This is Puzzle in Progress where we talk about jigsaw puzzles. For today we're going to be doing puzzle number six in our daily advent calendar and I have a little friend here who wants to help me pull the number. So as per usual I have my basket with all the numbers in it. Usually I show you the pile of numbers I've already pulled. They're behind me. I've already done puzzles number six, nine, four, four, six, nine, four, two, and 13, I believe. So these are all the numbers left. And can you pull one for me? All right, open it up. Tell me what it is. Five. <gasps> number five. All right, so I'm going to be doing puzzle number five. Let's go find which one it is. All right, so as per usual, I have the stacks here of puzzles. Do you want to find me number five? See how they have numbers? This says what? One, two. What number is that? 11. 12. 12. So you need to find me number five. five. What number is this? One. One, so it's not that one. Seven. Five. <gasps> five. All right, do you want to oh. open it up and see what one it is? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's the one that was missing a little bit. Beautiful. Tell me what your favorite part about this puzzle is. Uh, the two horsies and Santa. The two horsies and Santa. And all the Santa. presents. There's, it's really shiny. Let me hold it like that. So this is Santa's Christmas Supper, a 1,000 piece by Ravensburger. First Ravensburger we're doing this season. Do you think you'll help me build the puzzle or just break it apart at the end? I'll help you break it apart at the end. <laughs> break it apart, yeah, that's what I thought. This puzzle wasn't actually totally broken up in the box, so before I started sorting, I definitely had to do that to make it as authentically build the entire puzzle yourself as possible. Although, I'm not gonna lie, I did leave maybe two or three pieces already assembled. I know it was a matter of time where I was filming and I wasn't actually filming. So I just spent the last 26 minutes and 13 seconds working on my puzzle. You guys would have no idea because um, there's no video footage of it. So that's always fun. I'm glad it was short and sweet. Sweet. The reason I know it was 26 minutes and 13 seconds is because I was watching Sweet Boys, episode 3, Garrett and Andrew's podcast. They're hilarious. Yeah, so here we go. Off to get my daughter from school. A little bit upset, a little bit annoyed, but I mean, for you guys, 26 minutes is like 10 seconds. But like, I feel like I made a lot of progress in those 10 seconds. You know what I mean? Let's puzzle again. flip it around or flip yourself around if possible work on it from a different angle it's like fresh eyes every time
Remind me as I take a puzzle break to catch a Pokemon in Pokemon Go in a raid battle. But I didn't have him in my deck yet, so high five to me. All right, guys, so I'm done my puzzle. Here she is. Okay, we have some things to talk about. So first of all, first of all, let's look at the scene. It is gorgeous. It was a lot of fun to put together. However, um, this section here, do you see all these pieces that are just literally a different color? Like, what is happening? It's almost like they were like two different I don't it was printed quite I don't know I don't even know what's happening but it's like it can't even just be like the way the lights hitting it in the image because it's like not a gradient across pieces it's just sections that are different colors which is so weird Ravensburger are great quality so what is happening here aside of that um, I mean a bunch of the pieces are like edges are breaking off and stuff and I think that's just from prior use it is a secondhand puzzle but then also right here there's a line that goes the entire length of the puzzle how bizarre honestly for Ravensburger I'm pretty disappointed uh, because of this weird situation and because of that like very evident lightly colored stripe situation but the image as a whole is beautiful i mean it's not going to stop me from doing any more ravensburger but it definitely has me questioning what's up is that like so weird anyways yeah all right let's take this bad boy apart this is like my least favorite and most favorite part because i really like to clear the mat so i can do it in my next one however if you know me, you know I hate taking puzzles apart right away. I mean, this big old stack of puzzles kind of proves that. <laughs> I really like keeping them assembled for a while, but not with this series. I've been taking them apart. All right, so as always, let's look at the, um, what is this? The pickup quality? It passes the pickup test. It's a Ravensburger, they usually do. Uh, this one is pretty good. Whoops. Okay, I did break some of it. Um, yeah. Alright. Let's take her apart. How should we do this one? Should we do it like, should I lift it up and drop it? I mean, the pieces are already damaged, so. <laughs> okay, that was fun. What is up with me forgetting to do outros? All right, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you come back day after tomorrow for the next one. This was puzzle number six, so the next one will be number seven. Um, I'm really excited. I hope that you guys are excited. I hope that you're loving this series. I'm loving this series. This was so much fun to do. I love it. Did I say that already? Okay. Don't forget, you can hit that subscribe button if you want to support me and my channel. That would be amazing. I would love it. It's totally free and costs you zero dollars. That's what totally free means. Zero dollars. Um, also, I was posting at night. Don't mind my light. Um, also, you can follow me on Instagram at Puzzle in Progress to see up close shots of all of these puzzles and more. I post almost daily content on there. And what else can you do? Yeah. That's, you could hit that bell notification. That way you get notified when I post a new video. There you go. Okay, see you guys tomorrow. Not tomorrow. See you guys the after tomorrow. Bye.